Uh, just finally, guys, before we go, Manchester City, I watched the match against Brighton. They had a huge amount of possession, but it took them a long time to break down a fairly disciplined... Chris Hutton had done a good job and had a disciplined enough side uh, defending deep. Took them a long time, John, yeah. uh, to break them down. And there was one curiosity that, that he's playing th- uh, three at the back with Vincent Company on the right, John Stones in the middle and Otto Mendy on the left. I would have thought Company in the middle uh, would be more the thing rather than having yeah. him on the ball going forward. Yeah, I, I would I would as, as well, Eamon. But... Uh, uh, they definitely had a lot of possession, as we know. Uh, Brighton made it difficult for them. There's no doubt about it. But in the end, they did win 2 0. And sometimes you can draw those matches, you know. But what yep. was good about them, too, they didn't lose their patience. They kept playing and playing and playing and playing, which we always, well, I think we've always agreed, we encouraged teams to do that. Yep. He didn't bring a big fella on and say, change things dramatically. In other words, he believed in what he was doing. He had the players believe in what he was doing, like Ferguson did in his day when he was getting the Fergie time goals and all that. Yep. But they did win the match 2 0. And I don't think Brighton had a shot in goals. Um, so they did the job that they went down to. They picked up the three points, won, won comfortably in the end. Uh, but it was, it was a reasonable performance in what could, could on some occasions, be a difficult, perform- difficult game. Yeah, uh, Didi, um, he played Danilo, the guy they got, a squad player from uh, Real Madrid, a right back. He played him at left back. Uh, he left Sané on the bench, although he brought him on later on. I thought the team was a bit unbalanced, uh, although they got the result. It was an, almost an embarrassment of riches. The other thing is um, Aguero and Jesus as a partnership up front. I'm not sure that will work either. Uh, yeah, we've got to wait the, the next few weeks, how they shape up. Um, yeah, I probably expected Sané to play there. Uh, maybe wanted to be a bit more cautious in the in the first game. I, I think it, it kind of played into Brighton's hands because every time Danilo got the ball, yeah. um, he came back on his right foot and it, it narrowed the pitch uh, down an awful lot. Um, but uh, I think uh, Johnny summed it up perfectly well. They, they were patient. They, they had a few chances, and they, they tired. They tired Brighton out, and, and when they did get tired, they got a few chances. Eventually, took one, um, and, and they've got an embarrassment of riches, as you said. There's so many players for them to come as well. Um, the, the one question mark watching the game was was company. I think when they did lose the ball, when he had to chase back, um, I don't um, think he's anywhere near the player he used to be, and. Um, uh, that'll be a that'll be a the big question mark where uh, where company plays if he plays, but certainly they're the team to be this season. Okay.